Hey my queens and welcome to my channel. Very quick tutorial on this full cut crease glitter look. So keep on watching, let's get started. So I'm taking my brow pencil in the color dark brown. This is by Ruby Kiss. And I'm just gonna fill in my eyebrows with the pencil because especially in the summertime, I prefer a pencil over any gel or pomade. And it lasts so long, you guys. I don't even have to like set it with any setting powder or anything. So this is my preferred, my go-to brow pencil like every day. So I'm just gonna fill it in and I'm gonna clean it up with some LA Girl Pro Concealer and this is in the color Fawn. And I'm gonna clean up the bottom, just swiping it across, making it neat and shaping it as well. And then I'm gonna take the leftovers from what I use on the bottom and just go ahead and clean up the top with it. I clean up the top with the same color that I use the bottle because anyway when you put on your foundation you're gonna pretty much cover any what's up whatever you put on the top with it anyway so it's not really gonna look that light so, now I'm gonna take some gotta be glue spray and just like I like the way that it looks in the front when I feather out my um, brows and it just stays like that all day so now you're finished and you're ready to start your application of your eyeshadow. So here I'm going to take a dark brown eyeshadow and just go above my crease with that. And I'm going to blend it out really good, make it nice and smoky. And then I'm going to take a transition color. I think this was a, like a light, kind of like a light orange. And I'll go right above, right above that dark brown with it and blend it out really good. Just keep on blending till you can't blend anymore. You want it to look really natural. And then you're gonna go ahead and take a concealer of your choice and you're gonna cut your crease with it um i normally use a smaller brush but this is like i try to do this quicker <laughs> and i usually tilt my head back so i can you know see better tilt the head back look down into the mirror keep your eyes closed as small as you can <laughs> not really closed but you know what I mean? And just try to get it perfect and to your liking so I can match the other side. Okay. And then I'm going to put on some eyeshadow. This is from the BH Cosmetics palette. And it's a shimmer eyeshadow. Um, so I'm going to put that over what I just cut my crease with. So now I'm going to get my glitter glue from NYX in a nice, fine holographic glitter called Golden Eye. I got this from GlitterMyWorld.com and I'm just going to start at the very edge of where I cut my crease and I'm going to apply the glue very, very thin layer. You don't want it to be thick because then it's going to crack and crease and you don't want that. It's going to look nasty. So you're just going to smooth it out, very thin layer like I said, and then you're going to go ahead and apply the glitter onto your lid. And you don't have to drag the glitter all the way down to your lash line, so that way when you put on your eyeliner, it's not gonna be so clumpy and it's gonna be easier to put on. So I'm just gonna take the same dark brown from the eyeshadow palette and just go around the glitter to define it and then i'm gonna go ahead and take a liquid eyeliner this is from nyx as well and i usually prefer to use a gel liner but for the glitter you're just gonna use the liquid so that it goes on easily and it doesn't wipe off any glitter that you already did okay so that's it for the eyes you guys thank you for watching please a like and subscribe and also follow my instagram and your way page where you'll find more pictures and videos and also you can book me if you're in the nyc or connecticut area